In this video, I'm going to be updating my trade and sale binders for all of my Japanese stuff. So we're just going to start off with uh, the original Japanese base set. Um, prices are a little uh, over the place. Um, I'm thinking of just kind of going down to the standard uh, dollar for a hollow and 50 cents for a rare. There's probably going to be a few cards that are going to be exceptions, and especially when we get to the VS section, you know, that'll that'll be a, a big exception. But uh, I'm going to see how many cards I can move out of here at those prices. Um, right now, I'm just... Uh, you know, uh, moving into the new house and looking to try and, and uh, get a bit ahead on the mortgage payment. So just trying to clear stuff out and uh, get a little uh, extra money in from these things. So uh, these are just all non-hollow rares, except for the water energy. Um, it was actually a card you couldn't pull in the set, so that's why it's in the binder. Jungle hollows. And more jungle hollows on that side. Fossil hollows here. And more fossil Team Rocket. Uh, and now there's also, uh, occasionally I'll have cards where I'll have two per sleeve. So if you're interested in, like, uh, uh, I think I've got three Cedra, for example. Um, you know, just let me know if you're interested in multiple quantities. And uh, now we go to the Gym Series. Uh, non hollow rares for the Gym Series are on uh, this page. Uh, that is, um, uh, is it Imakuni? I think, I'm not sure how you say his name. Uh, Doduo, but it does have some damage. Uh, these are non hollow rares as well. Here is uh, are the Gym Challenge hollows. Uh, let's see, non hollows are here. I think the only two hollows on these this page are the Dittos. Uh, Genesis hollows. More hollows and then non hollow start over here. Been trying to clean these binders up a little bit, um, get out some of the loose pages, and uh, it's not doing too bad so far. Discovery, Revelation, a few more Revelation, and then Destiny. Hollows, and then we've got non hollow rares in this set as well. All right, so on to the second binder, where I've got the VS cards and uh, everything after that. <laughs> and I just noticed I have these things in the binder upside down, the pockets right there. And trying to, been trying to play around with different lightings in the house. Um, not very. Uh, honestly, I really prefer doing videos at my parents. Um, the lighting here just, it, it's terrible. Um, I've played around with it and I just can't seem to get something I like. Uh, VS series. So uh, for the hollow energy, I could probably go to a, a dollar or two. Um, there is a hypno over here. As far as all these cards, um, some of them, uh, I think on average, they're still going for like $3 a piece. I could probably go down to like a dollar or two each with maybe some exceptions like the Evolutions and Raichu and that sort of thing. Um, but I'm always, oh, always up for offers, so uh, feel free to make them. Uh, probably a few other exceptions. I think the, the Nine Tails, the Flareon for sure, and the Gyarados are worth a little more. Um, as far as these go, the Potions, uh, Warp Points, I can go down to like 25, 50 cents each. Uh, same thing with all these. Uh, you pulled so many of, of these. These are pretty common in the set. Uh, same thing here. TMs, probably looking at 50 cents to a dollar each for. Um, these are pretty common, you know, 25 cents each. A couple more TMs for like 50 cents to a dollar. Uh, the VS Energy, I've got uh, quite a few of them. Um, I don't know, like 10 cents, 25 cents, something like that. Just make an offer. Only have one Japanese expedition card left, um, the Cloister. And then these are just kind of all uh, all over the place. Uh, relatively newer series, Diamond and Pearl era. Um, hollows and rares. These are easy. I'm just going to put a dollar for anything that's a hollow, 50 cents for anything that's a rare. Um, I've got plenty of multiples, and we'll just kind of skim through these. Doesn't seem like many people are interested in these things, actually. So uh, that's why I'm going down on prices quite a bit for these things. See if we can get some of them moving. Um, I think these are all hollows. If you have a question whether something's a, a hollow or non-hollow, like these are hollows, 
non-hollow, and I have it said in the video, just feel free to ask. Rares. 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 Um, I think some of those along the top are hollows, and then we go to rares. I think those are hollows. Hollows, then rare. Rares. Uh, some good old triumphant stuff. These are rares. Um, oh, whatever their 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 dragon vault was. Uh, so all of these are hollows. Uh, I figured I'd go, you know, still pretty standard. I think a dollar. Um, maybe if you buy a bunch of them, I'd go down lower than that. And then some of the newer black and white sets. I think most of these are. Yeah, these are all hollows. More hollows. More, 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 more. I think the, uh, um, there just really weren't many rares printed in. Actually, I don't, yeah, I guess most of the black and white sets, I don't think, did any, any rares. So, nice in all hollows. More, more, more. And then these are various Japanese promos. Uh, we've got vending series cards, movie promos, um, just things I have duplicates of. And then uh, their shiny collection on the back. Um, actually, that may be a Korean card, but uh, yeah. Again, uh, if you're interested in anything, PM, uh, email, I'll even uh, try and go through some of the comments. Cash, money, order, PayPal. I'm up for trades as well if you have anything on my once list on thecatsmouth.com. Thanks everyone for watching and stay tuned for more updates.